Good morning children. This video is in continuation of video 1 formatting in a document. Changing the text keys. What do we mean by that? It means that we can change the text according to our requirement. For example, we have to click on this option this is the option we have to click on as you can see there are five types of text cases first one is the sentence case it will capitalize each word in a sentence lower case will help you to convert the text to lowercase, that means small alphabets. Uppercase will help you to change the text or convert the selected text to capital letters. Capitalize each word will help you to convert or change the first character of each selected word to uppercase. And toggle case converts the case of every selected character in a reverse manner. For example, a capital letter will convert into lowercase and vice versa. So let's try. For example, this is the sentence I've written. First of all, I'll remove uh, bold, italic and underline. Okay. So if I now apply sentence case, so only it will capitalize the first letter of the sentence. Just observe the change. See, everything came in small letters except for W. Why? Because W is at the beginning of the sentence. Let's see the next one. The next is the lowercase. Now observe that all the words or all the sentence or all the alphabets, they'll come in lowercase. The next thing is uppercase. So everything we've written, it will get converted into capital letters. See? The next one, let's try, is capitalize each word. So here, W, K, T, T, C and C will get capitalized. See? And last one is the toggle case. So earlier, Okay, now in the toggle case, all the letters that were capital earlier have become small and all the letters that were in small have become capital. Now, I can clarify this more by giving one more example. So, let's type hello and let's observe what will happen if we apply toggle case. Let's highlight it. And we'll click on toggle case. See, it has reversed the effect. Now, again, earlier it was in capital. Now, it is in small. Now, if we again apply toggle case, it will come in capital. So, this is toggle case. Okay, now, children, after this, let's do the text alignment. Now, what is alignment? Basically, Alignment. alignment is the positioning of text from the page. Now, by default, our text is always aligned towards the left side. We can align the text towards the right side or in the center or we can justify the text. So, let's try it. First of all, let me change the color of the uh, the text so that it is more visible to everyone okay now children aligning the text towards the left that means I'll select it and we have to this time work on paragraph group this group this is the option for alignment of the text 
okay so if i click on this there will be no change because already our text is aligned to us left so let's click it see there is no much change now if we align the text towards right all the text has been shifted towards the right and now if i align the text towards the center it will come in middle of the page or at the center of the page and now if i apply the justify option the text gets evenly distributed between left and right margin it is basically used for designing books magazines and newspapers so just observe the change see it has been aligned properly so there are four ways by which we can align the text one is left alignment then right alignment then center align and last one is justify so children do practice all these options on your laptops and computer systems thank you